This is probably gonna be a more serious video. I, uh, if you, more, more serious than the last ones. So I've just been, um, I think what's been most upsetful lately is I don't know if I'm an artist. I've been struggling with this for a long time. I've been uh, dealing with this pain for a very, very long time of where I can't, I just feel like I can't draw at all. Almost that it incites a rage inside of me. Like it's, and the reason I've been drawing ugly is because I've been killing my motivation specifically to specifically because of that and I don't, there's no pressure for me to be good anymore or to be a good artist and and all of that pressure is just self put on and the only reason I'm bringing this up today is because I've been posting, I posted like two videos to Twitter because that's where some, a lot of my internet friends are and where we, you know, talk and uh, exchange things. And they've just been just kind of random trash or me, I just rant about how much I hate the color green or <sighs> Lightning McQueen Healy's was the other one. And I have never gotten much interaction out of those near as much as or I've never gotten that much interaction out of my art versus out of those and I at first I thought it was just like funny and just ironic that nobody liked like people will look at my art and think like eh well I mean and and then I post in those videos and instantly I get like 15 likes, 124 views. Uh, everyone's talking about it. They won't stop sending me messages saying like, oh, wow, that, that, that's awesome. That's amazing. Or the video was so funny. I watched it three times. And it just kind of made me realize that I don't have any audience reach with my art. And maybe my art is just therapeutic for me only. Maybe it's just me trying to be selfish, expecting other people to like my work when maybe it's only meant for me. Maybe I wasn't really meant to be an artist. I, that's kind of hard for me because I always thought it was like a dream of mine and the only time I've ever really done art is when I wanted appreciation. Saying things like, wow, I can... <laughs> oh, saying things like, oh, I could do better. like, And then I would just sit there and, and draw just to prove to everyone else that I can do better. And then I would work at it really hard just to prove that I would get better. But I'm... At this point, I'm not entirely sure if I've gotten any satisfaction out of any of my drawings. And the only time I ever have gotten satisfaction out of my drawings is when I've made something ugly. Because it's extremely therapeutic to just like put all of those, those ugly feelings down onto the board. And I've been trying to do those one a day. And I've gotten less reach than I have ever gotten. I'm doing worse than I have ever been. I... There's just no hope for me. Um, and something that will take me like three months to finish will get me less likes than something I've made a ha-ha funny in two minutes. And a lot of you are just going to try and cheer me up and say, oh, just do what you love. If, if you keep persevering, you'll make it. 
and well, that's the thing I I liked making that video I didn't have a lot of fun um, there was a smile on my face the entire time I loved that too And I just can't tell if I'm pursuing this art thing anymore out of selfishness, out of a desire to be loved, out of a desire to be respected. I, I've i been kind of searching for that my whole life. I, there's just no admiration there. And I think that if uh, that's what I'm doing art for, I don't think that I should be an artist. I've always done it just to look for this. I guess I've always done it to find respect for myself or to, or maybe as an escape. There's only been like a couple of times when I've done it out of pure desire to paint um, and I know like every artist hates their artwork every artist is like always looking down on it but I don't know who I'm doing this for no and if nobody is getting any enjoyment out of my artwork I mean, eventually, somewhere along the line, there has to be a return value on what you put out there. And I'm not getting that. I have friends of mine who have been drawing for less time than me, for who are what most would call less skilled than me in terms of technicality that have gathered a fan base in that have well over quadrupled, quintupled, tripled my uh, return value. And um, I watched a guy who's not even interested in being an artist start drawing after me and get to get more followers on um, Instagram than me with less paintings with less drawings with less anything and <sighs> and nobody wants to say it to my face you know and that's, that's just how it's going to be. Like, nobody really wants to tell you to your face that it's not for you. But maybe I'm the only person who can say it to my face. I don't know yet. I don't know. 